I want to tell you a story about uh, the fig wasp and the fig tree. Mutualism is a type of relationship where both species benefit from living together and living with each other. And this has happened in nature over hundreds and thousands and millions of years. Um, and sometimes we call that co-evolution, where they can evolutionarize change over time with each other so that it benefits each other to be living with each other and they both can live long enough to reproduce, which is the whole goal of life in biology. So the fig wasp fertilizes the flowers of the fig tree. The figs are those fruits that you can eat or you can, you can eat them dry. It's really common to have them grown in, in West America, like in California. So the fig wasp, what it does is the female fig wasps already when it flies out of the fig from the beginning, it will fly around and it will pollinate all of the flowers of the fig tree and then it will find a fig to go into and burrow itself into and lay its eggs because it was already fertilized from a male uh, fig wasp uh, previously right whenever it was born. So the female fig wasp will lay its eggs in the fig and the eggs will hatch and the ones that have wings are female and the ones that are, have no wings are male and they will feed off the fig to survive and then the female fig wasps will mate with the male fig wasps and unfortunately the male fig wasps just stay in the fig and die. They're pretty much just made to um, reproduce. And then the female fig wasps that are already previously fertilized will again fly around, pollinate all of the flowers, and then find a fig to lay its eggs in, and the process starts all over again. So that is mutualism because the tree provides a home for the fig wasps, and the fig wasps pollinate the tree. And so it's just become this co-evolution and this mutualistic beneficial relationship.